DM to DF. It took me losing you to realize that nothing else really matters. To realize that hundreds of women are out there, but none are you. I see my entire future in your eyes. I want to pour everything I have back into you. You have given me a lot. And I just wish and hope and pray to be able to bring that back to you. To have a connection that's reciprocal. And I know I have taken a lot from you. Your time, your energy, your emotional support. But now, I just don't want to be a taker in this connection. Because being a masculine or male figure in your life, it should be my responsibility to be able to protect and provide for you. Whether it's financially or emotionally. I want something stable. I have always wanted that. But the way my life is set up, I have never seen positive connection. I don't have that influence around me. So, I know I have been slow to come towards you. But I promise you I'm on my way but I have to go at my own pace because if I rush in, I'll feel like I'm going to ruin it again. If I move as fast as I want to, then I know things may again messed up. And this time more terribly. You know how that saying goes, fools rush in. And I don't want to be a fool. I want to come towards you and do things the right way. And build things the right way. So that they last. I know I have taken a long time. I have juggled ideas of what the future could be like with you. I have also juggled you with other people. And I know... I was wrong for that. I know that I hurt you. I put all these knives in your back and truthfully, I don't even know why. I know that who you are to me now, you are something special. And you know, I just self-sabotage because I don't wanted anything to ruin my life. My experience regarding love and emotions were so toxic. That's why I was afraid of you and your love. I thought it could also ruin my life. And that's the only reason why I pushed you so away from me. And really, that was my biggest mistake as well as my biggest regret. I know I left you all up in your head. I went silent, wondering if my stability is in you. And not that you bring me stability, but my life could be what I have always dreamed of. It would be. But it's also true that it was always a dream until I met you. You bring that dream to reality and I panicked. But in this panic, I saw it all so clearly. Whatever options I thought I had, whatever decisions I thought I was really making, kept me stuck and bound by Nothing. I want to turn the page. 
I want to bring you all that happiness that you deserve. And I am coming to you with all my love. And I hope and pray that you, my queen, accept it. Because this love that I have is only for you. I have this strong feeling that together we will have that kind of relationship that people only see in movies. We will bring a new sense of enlightenment to everyone around us and also an opportunity to believe in the impossible because we made it possible. I miss you. There is so much that happens on day to day and all I can think about when I lay at night is holding you. Holding you so I can let go of all my burdens. I want you in ways that I never wanted anybody. Your body makes my body tremble and hot. My inside being celebrate when I am with you. And it's a kind of feeling that I never had before. I know that I haven't been the best. I know that I left you alone. I left you feeling less but not because you were less than anyone. It's because I was left less. I had that self-worth issues within me. And truly, it took me losing you to realize that nothing else really matters. To realize that there are hundreds of women out there but none of them are you. None of them do it for me the way you do. None of them would take a stand for me the way you do. You are the only woman in my life who made me see what and how strong, real, authentic women looks like. Subscribe for more upcoming channeling. Thank you dear soul family.